This is what you see. But the reality is there is so much that goes on that you don't see to get to this. I want to take a moment and show you one of the tools that I use to make what you do see easier and faster. Hey, before we jump into this video, help me out by liking this video. If you like tech, gear, and drum reviews on my channel, that'll let me know this is the kind of content you want to see more of. Now let's hop into the video. One of the tools that I use across almost all of my editing platforms and on a daily basis is the Loop Deck Live. Now, if you've never heard of a Loop Deck before, it's basically a monster macro pad and contains tons of buttons and dials that you can customize to do a bunch of different functions across your favorite platforms to make your editing, your work quicker and easier. Okay, so let's check out the Loop Deck and this is what it looks like when I open my computer. So. Physically, it's got eight buttons across the bottom, it's got six dials, and then we have 12 buttons here, and then these little panes show you what each dial controls. Now, not only do the dials turn, but they also can click in the dials turn, but they also click in, which gives an extra layer of functionality there. Now, what's really cool about these is, as you can tell, this just looks like a flat screen, but each one of these buttons, if you press them, actually give you a little bit of haptic feedback, um, and so I'm gonna see if you can hear that now. As far as the build quality of the Loop Deck, it's really nicely constructed. Everything just feels really sturdy. Um, these dials are really well constructed. The buttons just feel really great. So as far as just kind of the overall aesthetic and experience, um, it's, it's great. Now you can see just how slim this is. Now there comes with a little bracket here that I can take off if I'd like to lay this flat. So as far as portability, this thing is pretty easy to take around. Just for reference, you can see this is my iPhone. So you can tell this Loop Deck is pretty thin. So if you want to throw it in your backpack or something like that, it's pretty easy to do so. And then again, this is just a simple plastic bracket that I can put on here. Now a couple more things about the Loop Deck in general. You'll see that you've got seven um, different buttons here. Now these can be different pages on your Loop Deck. So I've got two pages of kind of um, shortcut keys and then it's got a calculator and you can make more than that. But another thing that's really neat, not only can I click through the different screens, but I can also swipe here on the screen to go to different pages and I get a haptic feedback when I do that. So really interesting. Now what gets really cool is the dynamic mode. So again, this is what it looks like just when I open my computer. I've got shortcut keys here. I can change my volume, screen brightness, things like that, do a screen capture. But when I open up a program, say Final Cut, this goes into dynamic mode, so it opens up the shortcut keys that I've created or different commands. And this is where it gets really interesting. And for the sake of this video, I'm not gonna dive into all the things that I have set up, but um, on Loop Deck's website and in the uh, accompanying software, you can download all kinds of profiles or build your own. But this is where it really shows and shines um, is you can do that. Now, the other one that I use a lot is Photoshop. So in Photoshop, again, there are multiple, I use a lot of these preset ones here in Photoshop but it's great because it can speed up your workflow with different buttons um, and things that you can do uh, that make it shorter and quicker commands that you can then program. So uh, those are just some of the things that I really like about Loop Deck. Um, and again, it's really neat is the, these buttons that may not look like physical buttons, but the haptic feedback just gives you an interesting experience. Um, another thing that I've done is at a conference, I set up a pro presenter. And so a lot of people use this for pro presenter. You can program lights, um, different things. If you want to do presets where someone can come up and not really know a lot about the program, but you can build presets where this, you know, they push a button and it launches the logo. So I had a conference where I was using this with pro presenter and I had some volunteers helping that didn't know a lot about pro presenter itself, but I just set up some simple buttons where they could do logo, they could clear all and things like that. I've also used them in a context to run a lighting software uh, where we set up a couple of easy scenes where a volunteer could come up and press a scene and it would launch into that. So the loop deck, is an incredibly powerful device um, and there's layers to it. There's so many things you can do with it depending on the program that you use. But again, for me, it speeds up my workflow um, in simple ways like just having some hot, uh, some shortcut keys here for um, different programs and apps and websites I wanna launch. And then within Final Cut Pro, I've got some shortcuts set up that make my editing and I've customized it to the ways that I edit to make it faster to get my videos knocked out. And that is just scratching the surface of what a loop deck can do. There is so much more in the companion software and all kinds of stuff. I'll link some of my favorite videos below in this video. Um, but I wanted to give you an overview because no matter what you use, whether it's Logic, Final Cut Pro, or a different editing software, the loop deck has proven to me to be something that I use on a consistent basis to make my editing and workflow faster and easier 
when I'm working by myself, that is a really essential thing to me. Um, I've got this linked in the description below. I wanted to give a special shout out to Sweetwater for hooking me up with this Loop Deck Live. Um, really appreciate it. And if you got any questions about the Loop Deck or other things that I use here in my studio, please comment below and make sure that you're subscribed to this channel uh, for more drum reviews, gear reviews, and stuff like this. If you want to see more editing stuff like this, let me know. What do you want to know about? I'd be happy to help you out. Uh, but yeah, this is the Loop Deck Live. I highly recommend it if you're looking to increase your speed and productivity efficiency in your workflow. We'll see you in the next one.